And I haven't seen this particular matchup before either. I have not seen her fight Coma yet. So careful uh, or curious to see how Armando will approach against the armor. Yeah, I think a lot of the reasons, uh, not reasons, but like a lot of things you gotta fight against Coma is just grab him back, right? Yeah, and I think that the armor, the, the way that Aki approaches in Oki, uh, with the ring, Oki mm -hmm. kind of sitting on top. She doesn't have to commit to like a no. meaty 2A the majority of the time. Yeah. And I think a lot of, you know, in the air, people will throw the B ring in the air. Yeah. In this matchup, I'd like to throw the A ring in the air because she kind of drifts away from Koma, especially if he like wakes up with any kind of armor. Um, but the arm, of course, we've seen him play time and time again. Great matchup knowledge. Oh, oh caught him looking. Yeah. Gonna get the hard knock down there. Yeah, I think that was a that was two BC. Yeah, he did a moon drive and then just oh, went ahead and burnt man. the moon skill since he yeah, was activated. Mars. And Mars is just on, rolling on this round. Putting on a showcase here with Coma. Oh no! Yeah, this is not a good start for the arm at all. That's sort of what we saw in his match against Chris Chaos, where he just kind of found the right turnaround in a round he was losing, and then steamrolled uh -huh. from there. But the arm gonna get first hit again. Yeah, really nice. I think uh, Mars kind of with the button there. The yeah, arm. there we go. I think the the big thing is the arm uh, the arm missed his jump cancel uh, two three six B yeah. last time, so he wasn't really able to start his Oki properly. All oh, DP's out. Oh, DP out. Oh, yeah, got rid of the ring too. Oh, oh and snatch no, your DP. Yeah. Gonna blood kinda, heat. Yeah, forcing that blood heat. Or regular there. heat. Oh. I'm sorry. Okay, B B. Back throw for like positioning. B, A, A. Oh, oh yeah, no. he baited out the armor, but does get yeah. duffed by the overhead. Oh, BC follow up against the shield. Great awareness from the arm. Burn your magic circuit. Not a lot of magic cert to go around, actually. Yeah, the game's telling them to burn, and there's one bar combined yeah, between the two what? of them, and now that's gone. And now bars there's zero bars between them, yeah. The magic circuit is burnt. I hope you're happy, nice. game. Going for the DP setup. Didn't go into launcher at all. Great block from Mars. Oh, nice stagger, wow, though, so into nice. the 2C. That's a good starter. Yeah. And oh, the reset wow, caught the, the tech reset trap. Caught the, the jump out there. Yeah, no follow up from that. Oh, oh good. Good yeah. delay by Mars. I think the arm was like, got him, and yeah. Mars delayed his action just enough, and now he has the corner position. Yeah, Mars like calling out that DP wake up from Akiga to get a full conversion. Oh, wake up DP. Nice, he's getting a lot of that life back, and as soon as I say yeah, that, the Yeah, the moon drive and the, the three BC anti-air. Yeah. Able to get the jump cancel there that's and a, get the that's conversion. That's a really good call out from Akiha. If they're stuck See. blocking that ring in the air, you're able to kind of do a lot of ground normal to get that pick up uh, and, you know, get the round by uh, the arm. Really nice. Oh, good block on the 2 one 4 a Takes his turn. Oh, gets yeah, caught though. Shield BC. Man. And that full conversion from the arm going from 2C to the charge by B. Yeah, that's a little bit harder to do from like a grounded hit confirm, but yes. if you know you're going to have the hit, 2C into the charge 5B is nice because it keeps them lower to the ground, which makes it easier to combo yep. off. Well, basically, later on in the combo, it's easier to finish the lower they are to the ground. Mm -hmm. But oh, wow. Mars just cranking out the damage here. Even though he kind of got hit by a lot of the armor that Akiha has off of like 2BC. Um, oh, armor's able... through, gets the air to air. Oh, good. Yeah. Especially Akia Ak Ak definitely relies on that JA a bit to get started sometimes. She needs that air to air to get a conversion. Oh, yeah. Oh, call out on the high shield with a command grab. And another one, Again. but not this time. Yep. Yeah, not this time. The arm, though, lost a lot of health before he could even get started. Oh, we'll run up blood heat. Run up blood heat. Back at no you. shield there. Oh, oh, he tried it. Yeah, yeah, he tried it. He really did, yeah. This is going to do a lot of damage, and that is going to take it for Zen Mars. The second game here is this 1 1. Uh, for both of these players. Wow, that was a. Uh, <laughs> we're seeing some really great stuff from both of them. Um, kind of knowledgeable on wake up, knowledgeable on a lot of, you know, trying to call out the shield there. Oh, the late JB, yeah. yeah. Nice. Yeah, throwing out the shield. Oh, the ring. Oh, yeah. Yeah, caught him back second. Yep. And again, nice another tech trap. Again. Yeah, able to get the ring in the air. Good block on the IAD JB there. He's gonna spend that, uh, spend that moon drive. Oh no! The arm with the right read on the low, but 2C came out the wrong direction. Now yeah. he's gonna be put back in the corner. Even though he has the life lead, but not for long! Great fatal counter for the air. He's dead. Up. Yeah. yeah oh, oh no, there's a big drop though! 
Not able to get the Abari just yet, but gonna oh, get the BC follow up. He yeah. has he, he has Arc. If he can just get to the ground. Okay, yeah, I like I that. I think he shielded that two BC from Coma and was able to get that BC follow up from the shield. Yeah, really nice from the. Yeah, end. I also like the uh, the the six BC there. The the moon scale fireball yep. held uh, Mars in place, and that would have given enough to burn the arc drive if he yeah. needed to. Nice defensive jump back, JB. Good challenge. Yeah, that's not her turn after she is slightly minus. Interrupt from the air there wasn't the same Again, time. Mars trying to get the grounded anti-air, but yeah. this is not really a grounded anti-air game. Yeah, we see the arm kind of going for the DP. Oh man, the DP. Just to get through the ring there. Oh, uh, yeah, the nice. stare down ending it in the command grab. Yep. Gonna get the punish here though. Uh-huh. Just a very simple combo from Akiha. Set up with the B-Ring! Great block from the Mars. I'll have to double check with him, but I think in that combo, uh, what he did was use the C-Ring. Oh, that's a command grab, yep! He did the C-Ring, and then he did the DP yeah. in between the hits, but the last hit of the combo is the final hit of the C-Ring, which makes it a hard knockdown because it's an EX. Yeah, and is that going to be it? Yep. Yes, it that's is! That's going to do it. Nice back and forth match. Kind of a slugfest between these two. Yeah. The arm super like optimal with that combo there just to like close out the game. Yeah. Um, but that was still pretty close. I wouldn't say that was a dominant round from either character or either player. Um, but both of them showing a lot of knowledge with their character. Um, and Mars putting on a great showcase with Coma. Wow. All right, so look at what we have remaining. Uh, that was our first match of our top eight. Yep. That's going to send Mars down to the loser side. The mm -hmm. arm's going to move on to winner's final. Uh, Backlash against Bright Side. Uh, this is going to be, you know, I don't know a lot about Backlash. He's been looking pretty good, but yeah. he, I'm looking at him. He's kind of a young kid. Uh, mm -hmm. Not Maybe not a kid, but he's <laughs> significantly younger yeah. than Bright Side. We're yeah. going to yeah. sort of see, you know, if the difference it's, in experience yeah, does something, or, you know, sometimes uh, the younger players just, they got the hands. Is this going to be an arc mirror match? I could be wrong. No, I think you're correct. It is an arc mirror match. Wow. Uh, like you said, Brightside having a little more uh, season kind of game knowledge behind his belt, but still we've seen Backlash doing some really great stuff with arc. It'll be interesting to see it, this is like a mirror first mirror match. Is yeah. like not Always, it doesn't always come down to who the better overall yeah. player is, right? It kind of comes down to like who makes the correct guess on yep. how the other person's going to utilize the character. Because the scariest trap to fall into in a mirror match is assuming that they're going to do what you would do. Yes, exactly. Yeah, and even though it is like you know five five matchup between these characters, like you said, a lot of people have different play styles. That great wake up DP from Backlash. Yeah, Backlash burning his Moon Drive to get the slowdown. Yep. Saw the overhead there, caught the DP. And that Moon Drive really does kind of burn really slowly. Again, Fatal Counter, no pickup, but Backlash still able to get the low there, picking nice. up full combo Good conversion. in the corner. Oh yeah, awareness from right side, just going to the Moon Drive. Clash, nice. yeah. yeah. Everyone stay safe, nice move. challenge. Yeah, nice challenge. DP's through. Oh, daggers for both of them. Yeah, and then they went. For yeah, the back. respectful. Well, I mean, they're both sitting on three bars, yeah. so they just yep. assumed the other person was gonna throw some shit out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right side. Nice, down. good yeah, heat. Nice yeah, nice heat. Getting all that life back. Pausing the timer. Wow, this round cannot get more even. This is just <laughs> yeah. the first round of this set. Yeah, seriously. Yeah, timer restarted again. And Backlash uh, gonna get the hit. Doesn't get the knockdown, but able to recollect it with yeah. another 2A. Should get the corner if he finishes this combo. Yeah, ABC throwing into the corner. Oh wow. no! That is a rough break for Bright Side. Really, really rough. Spent the moon drive, but still was sort of just wrong on what side Backlash was on. Yeah. That's gonna cost him his whole moon gauge going kind of into this round. Backlash like jumping back over. You saw that jump C crossed up, and the you know Bright Side just got hit by it. Oh, straight to super though. The super. And yep. again, yeah, yep. Moon Drive sees it. Able to get the DP. Nice jump back anti -air. Yeah, we've seen Backlash like do DP right out of Moon Drive cancel. Wow, oh, no, that was sick. DP'd out of the shield. Yeah, Brightside jumping back over. Not gonna call out the heat on Wake Up, but still gonna EXDP. And again, these reactions of like seeing the shield and just sort of DPing away. Oh yeah. 
Far type making his. Uh, yeah, nice taking the round over backlash one one for both these. I'd players. be really curious to know how real of a strategy that is to like <laughs> yeah. DP when you see shield to just avoid the RPS. Yeah, yeah. Because uh, you know nobody really wants to deal with RPS, but at the same time. It's like, how do you deal with it? I do. I'm not going to beat people with footsies in this game. <laughs> Shit, let's go. I'm yeah, doing BC follow-up, yeah, baby. I'll do BC air throw, yeah. Yeah, I know what my combo <laughs> is off of uh, the, the BC shield follow-up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh! Ah, uh, no true shield battle here. Backlash once again. Oh, bright side out of there. <laughs> good block in the air by Backlash. Yeah, we're seeing these air footsies that we saw, you know, a good amount of times tonight. Nice, yeah, 2A, 2A. Both of these players nice are grab. actually doing a really good job of like picking the clutch time to just block. Yes. As much yes. as they're moving and as aggressive as they're being, there's some individual oh. interactions where they're like, this is yeah, not my turn. Just like that, and Brightside canceling in a moon drive and able to go into the moon skill as well. Got those clash frames. Totally in this advantage, taking that first game over backlash. Yeah, and Clash in this game comes to you pretty fast. A lot of times it just comes down to who sees it first. Yep. I personally, I, I would like if Clash maybe was a different color, because sometimes to me it's hard to discern a Clash first yeah. if they shielded. Especially on that, uh, like a stage like this where it's yeah. like completely blue. Yeah. Wow. Really nice. Good pickup. Yeah, full combo there from Brightside. Oh, Out of yeah. there, yeah. Spent if you're bright side, that's fine, though. He spent his whole moon drive, yeah. and now you have the hit mid-screen. Doesn't spend anything on it, but he gets another one. He's got the follow-up there, just landing frames of Backlash. Yeah, Backlash, yeah, nice conversion off. Of the, oh, that's uh, a big whiff, yeah. yeah nice. Pausing the... Backlash, I, you know, maybe the equivalent of a hero burst, but he went all in with his resources. Moon mm. gauge is gone, regular gauge is gone. Oh, he tried to dash in, Brightside catching him out of it. This is a full combo, putting himself back into the corner, but yeah. Yeah, yep. and there's the mix. Yep. And depending on when he does that, I believe he can get like a falling JB or something, yes. or yeah. he can get the, the 2A, the empty low. Yeah, you saw that IAD went into the uh, the neutral jump, and that's kind of like the mix of where is she going to be on which side. See it again, right here, went for the low 2A into the follow-up, pushing back. And Backlash actually was crouching, he just kind of picked the wrong direction. Yeah. All right, TP's oh, out. Nice, yeah, TP's out. They just jabbing him out. We see these air footsies as well, the ground footsies as well. Brightside picking it up once again. Oh, yeah. The backdash read was actually a good one, uh, but unfortunately, right side just sort of made, uh, again, like I said, right, just the really clutch decision on when to stop mm -hmm. being aggressive, and he called out the, the wake up DP with the meaty shield and yep. allowed him to recover in time to punish the backdash. So, yeah. nice call out. Yeah, but, you know, right side kind of adjusting to backlash's play style. Um, I think that's the first uh, mirror match we saw on stream. I could be wrong, but uh, really nice showing for both players. Yeah. But Brightside able to take it out 2-1 uh, two or 2-0 two over... Uh, it was 2-0, oh, yeah. 2-0, oh, yeah. That that's first round was such a, slug, a slugfest that it I made know. it seem like a longer <laughs> set. But yeah. Coming up next, we're going to have Macho coming up against Emily. Uh, Emily was looking pretty good uh, yep. early on. Emily uh, joining us from uh, originally from uh, Tekken. I knew her yes. as a Tekken 7 player. Uh, She's been dabbling in a lot of different games, though. Mm -hmm. She was definitely playing Street Fighter V for a good amount. Uh, we talked a bit. Uh, she was playing oh, Sakura. Okay. So, uh, you know, someone after my own heart. <laughs> She's been playing a, a good amount of games, you know, like you said, we know her from Street, uh, not Street Fighter 5, <laughs> we know her from Tekken, yeah. but she is transitioning into Melty Blood as well. I was talking to her earlier, and I was like, you know, just enter, entering uh, Melty Blood tonight, and she said, yeah, she's playing CL. Um, so this is going to be a CL versus Vlog matchup. So uh, this is a very interesting matchup that I don't, I don't really think I've seen before. I feel like fighting Vlog is so much more of a level one knowledge check yeah. than yeah. most characters in the game, right? Like, mm -hmm. Vlav is, we saw it with DPS. DPS, you know, winning last week, our first week of Melty. Mm -hmm. uh, just, you know, like sometimes you have an idea of how to get in. We saw the arm successfully taking yeah. down Macho earlier, but then sometimes you're like, how the fuck does this character work? And you get perfected <laughs> by his owner. Like, yeah. And the arm kind of came on commentary and he was like, yeah, he utilized super jump a lot. Yes. There, there's sort of a, I don't want to call it a dead zone, but the angles that Vlad has to 
even though he's a zoner, yeah. I don't want to quite call it quite Dalsum style, but he does have to choose which uh, spot on screen he's going yeah. to cover with his projectile. Yeah. And if you're a bit further out, if you're not in the mid-range like a bit further than that, the super jump hop can sort of thread the needle between the two, the up forward angle and the straight on angle in a lot of different mm -hmm. situations. So mm -hmm. uh, again, we'll have to see kind of what Emily knows yep. about this matchup. And I think the mobility in the air kind of favors CL a lot. She can kind of deal with a lot of the zoning that Vlad wants to do. So it'll be interesting how Emily deals with a lot of the approach that uh, Majo has. Yeah, but, but again, the big thing with Vlad is if he's correct when he thinks where you're going to go, if he guesses where you're going to go and he's right, you lose yeah. that exchange. Nice, though, using the skill edge. Going to get in. And the throw, and Emily able to get some party started. Oh, the clash, that actually worked out really well for him, but going to get picked back up by the moon skill here. Yeah, Macho, he wasn't really able to deal with the keys there, but still great pickup as well. And, and this is, this is normal for Macho in games. Macho usually burns his resources offensively. Things like yeah. moon gauge that can be used both defensively or offensively, he's usually going to do that of like mm -hmm. activate moon drive and start burning moon skills. Yes. And you can see that's exactly what yes. I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, he uh, really likes to favor that back moon skill for Blob. Uh, has a lot of good armor, and if you're not blocking, it's going to catch you as well. It, it actually won twice out of the clashes. I mean, in clashes, yeah. it's just a, a big hitbox right in front of him. Mm -hmm. And again, you saw that full screen from, confirmed from Blob. That's kind of low okay. fireball. Yeah, nice from Emily. Yeah, I, Emily's doing a good job using the enhanced projectile options just to yep. get through. Uh, so we'll see kind of what she can make happen here. But yeah, she got that re-jump combo as this well. This is fine. But, oh. oh, this is less fine. She actually had really good patience for a moment. Uh, yeah, overextended yes. a little on the shield B follow-up. Okay, nice wake up beat. Yeah. I think you got her right. This is, uh, you're already down around. Yep. Good shields. Oh, the shield. Yeah, I think Macha was kind of like trying to call out the, the B shield follow-up yeah. from Emily, but really smart she was able to kind of call out anything from macho getting that second round over him and that, and, uh, that shield yeah. able to cap off a little bit of extra moon meter but she tried to use the moon skill there and got stuffed yep oh the run up grab oh, so nice oh and the frame kill macho it being real sweaty right now yeah i think emily is just holding oh down the back. double overhead oh, oh no God. i got hit yeah i definitely got hit I got hit by that way too many times. Oh, oh faded no. out the reversal. Faded out the DP from and he's Emily. working on arc drive here. Is yeah. he going to be able to get? No, he's not going to spend it. This, oh, yeah. yeah, I was about to say, Emily, she would have a very tough time kind of coming back from a lot of the pressure that Macho was able to put on. I mean, you can on. see there, he finished with three bars and full moon gauge. Yeah, so even much. if Emily got out of that situation, oh, she yeah. was so far behind it in both life and resources that that was going to be a really difficult mm -hmm. road back. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. <laughs> The, yeah. the falling recovery <laughs> oh, of no. her air projectile just sort of threaded the needles through yeah. gloves. And I think Emily kind of taking oh, a little punish. more. I was literally about to say like a cautious approach, but yeah, screw that. Yeah, there's no cautious approach in this game. Nice! nice. And maintains the corner. Oh no, with the back BC, the poor BC again from Macho, working out so much in his favor going into the EX. Again, calling it out. Nice grab. Oh. oh, yeah, the air normal came out the wrong way. I think yeah. Emily had a moment of just like, what just happened? Because yeah. Vlav was facing the wrong she direction. She might have been a little flustered by, you know, him facing the wrong direction. Yeah. He's just fanning butt in her face. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Oh, oh, and again, my God. Uh, like Macho, you know, he says he's his auto main. He's starting to look like a Kai here. <laughs> I hate to yeah. say it. Seriously, the run up grab from like half screen. Oh <laughs> my God, I can't. He did it again. Good block in the double overhead, though. And Emily able to find the challenge. Emily, no. Ooh, yeah, wow. would have maybe liked to see the back throw there. I, I really would have liked her, like, throwing him back towards yeah. the corner. Oh, nice, though. Good conversion. But yeah, still, as soon as I say that. Nice throw again. And she's playing around the shield really well. You know, I'm going to stop talking. <laughs> she she was correct on the shield callouts three straight yeah. times, and then right when I wanted to point that out, oh, oh shields the last arc. Oh, that was very expensive. Up, that was the last of her meter. Good tech. Well, okay. Oh, my God. All what of them are on the floor. On? The rocks are what on the floor. The paper's on, yeah. on the floor. The scissors are just spilled everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> they, those, those two were definitely throwing some options at each other. 
Yeah. Uh, you saw Emily kind of wake up with that ABCD, and which is goes right into last arc, does do as much damage as Blood Heat into Shield. Um, I think it does like 5,000 or 4, 4,500 or something. Um, but yeah, that was the start between uh, that like Shield interaction between these two and Macho taking it in his favor, moving on in the loser's bracket. Um, unfortunately, that's going to be it for Emily, but she has shown some really great stuff with CL. I don't think I've seen anybody else play CL in this bracket. Yeah, so coming up next, I'm excited for this one. <laughs> oh, I'm excited yeah. because the truth is out there. Ramsey's a weeb. Yeah, we got him. Ramsey's we got a him. Weeb. Let's go. He's a weeb. Yes. <laughs> Everyone submits eventually. <laughs> Ramsey coming to us from uh, Street Fighter Five, one yep. of our uh, best Street Fighter players in yep, the area. Yep. Uh, during quarantine, was really making a name for himself uh, online mm -hmm. in Street Fighter Five, doing really well at MB NLBC on a regular basis, both with the Sagat and the Zangi. Uh, we'll see what he's thinking on character choices. Yeah. Leans towards the grapplers yes. relatively often, but not always. I did see him play against... But there uh, it is. There's yeah, the grappler. There yeah, so yeah, yeah. I was literally about to say he was playing against one of our other Street Fighter V players. Um, oh, my God. So the, the I mentioned it, right? <laughs> yeah. If you are a grappler player, Koma's like pretty yeah, good. Yeah, you're going to Koma. Meanwhile, if you're a rushdown player, Injin yeah. Soku is firmly a rushdown player. Whoa, whoa, opening whoa, whoa, with whoa. What the heck was that? Yeah, there goes all his bar. That was yeah, like one that's, bar. That's unfortunate, but he's going to spend the Moondrag. Oh, yes. Jinsoku is spending cash. Yep. Uh, I did see uh, Ramsey nice. playing Mike Shield. Yaru. He was the other kind of coma player. Yes, both of them. Yep. Oh, oh big punish. Yeah, 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 big punish. Uh, Koma's unique, you know, we can kind of see it here in this gameplay, but he doesn't have that BCBC air throw that we see a lot of yeah. characters have. Yeah, have to have a different different approach yep. uh, in terms of ending combos. Like, as soon as he does 3C, it just goes right into C and then air throw. Yeah. Yeah. Which, you know, uh, fortunately it, for uh, Ramsey here yeah. as well, though, I mean, we have multiple Koma players. Uh, of course, Mars, we saw. He has a lot of people who he can just, in between games, be like, hey, what's the route off this? Yeah, yeah. Oh, caught the back Oh, dash. wow, yeah, no counter there, so it wasn't a big pickup. But, yeah, you see a lot of Koma players kind of charging that jump C, charging the 5C, charging the 2C. All of those moves have armor. All right, Jitsoku finally able to get some pressure started. Yeah, Wins out on nice. the clash situation. Yeah, that to... unblockable from Shiki has armor and also, nice. you know, like I said, un unblockable. Gets the back get out, though, yeah. yeah, I like that option of the DP, moon skill DP trading, not fully in full. Ramsey still holding his own. Good patience, yeah, blocks and it out. Nearly full moon skill from him as well. Also, almost full oh, magic full circuit, but I don't think not he's going to get to use yeah, it. Not going to kill yet. Yeah, he's getting, he can. Oh, nice throw Big break. Tech. Okay, he tried to armor out, yeah. I think, but yeah. didn't have the health. Yeah. Uh, so that 2-2-C from uh, Koma is an armor move. It gives a lot of armor to pretty much everything that he does. And, you know, 2-2-A and 2-2-B. I just realized that either, no, because he had full moon gauge. I think because he died in the armor, he didn't get charged the meter because he started oh, this round okay. with four bars. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, not your turn. Uh, your turn just that, yet. I think compared to a lot of games, if you're coming from other games, when you block a jump in in Melty Blood, even if it is fairly high up, it's not your turn. It, nope. You're going to think <laughs> it's your turn. Yeah, you can jump cancel that on Whiff, I believe. Yeah, you know, Jin Soku DPing. He went into the Moon Skill DP, was still able to. Oh, like, we're, back with the we're Ragna oh, players, again. baby. If you think you're going to give us a jump Command cancelable grab? DP and a Ragna player is not going to be mashing it, you're out of your fucking mind. Oh, yeah. Ramsey went into, you know, trying the command grab arc drive, but at the same time, Shinsoku had enough knowledge to jump out of it, got a full punish as well. That's going to be the first game over Ramsey. <laughs> oh, dashing into each other. All right. I like to see that free round. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Full conversion. Oh, no. Not a full conversion from Jinsoku. And Ramsey putting the Good pressure. Yeah, nope. gonna slide. Spent the moon skill, so it is safe. Yeah, Ooh. It is safe. Nice. Oh, yeah, he got the fatal counter off the uh, that air approach. Man, Jisoku getting the best of these clashes, but yeah, yeah. Ashen 2A caught the Abare. I think uh, Koma kind of benefits from that Madden 2A a lot. Nice. Good check on the command grade. Nice. Oh, oh wow. what timing. Oh, yeah. And good choice to normal to come down with to punish the whiff there. Yep. Not going to kill just yet, but still has access to those Nadia moves. Yeah, he went right into it, the moon skill. Yep. 
perfect. Jinsoku one round away from taking it in this loser's bracket, but still great start from Ramsey. Yeah, I feel like Ramsey's definitely getting the hits. Maybe yep. just not quite. The, he, he's not having the Mars combos, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you see there, like, he wanted to dash up uh, Command Grab, but still Jinsoku going right into the Moon Drive to negate that. And I like Jinsoku's strategy of just continue going in, right? If the other person is not yep. maximizing their hits against you and you can maximize yours, yeah. then you're just in a match of who's going to do the most damage. Yeah. For sure. Nice. Command grab there. Yeah, got the OTG as well. Oh, no. He tried to actually read that, but oh. that's going to do it. Yeah, Ramsey taking seventh place. I mean, good showing for him tonight. Seven. Yeah, really good showing. Yeah, out of uh, 27, I believe. So. Yeah, I think so. First time entering a Melty tournament. Pretty solid there. Good to see more Koma players around. You know, like I said earlier, Yaru, Mike Yaru, who is a mm -hmm. uh, pretty prominent Street Fighter V player, playing some Melty Blood as well. A lot of uh, encourage encouragement from the community. Carrying over into Ramsey. And Jinsoku uh, yeah. actually going to have to stay put. Uh, yes. Macho, I believe, is in a Strife match at the moment. Now, Jinsoku just getting past Ramsey has unlocked the coma boss, right? That was the, <laughs> you thought the comas were done. No, they're just keep coming in. Here's, here's the second wave, Mars sitting down. And uh, yeah. Ramsey's sort of getting his footing in Melty. Uh, Mars kind of knows what, what he's doing. Yeah. He's, uh, if Jinsoku is, you know, not on top of things, he's going to be eating significantly more damage mm -hmm. than he was. I think, you know, like we saw him earlier from Mars, he really likes to favor those armor moves in the air, a lot of armor moves on the ground as well. Um, so it'll be interesting to see how Jinsoku handles a oh, coma that is a little more seasoned than yeah. Ramsey oh, no. just coming over from Street Fighter V. Okay, moving here. <laughs> oh man, Mars opting to just hold. But he forward. actually gets punished. He whiffs and his landing recovery gets hit. Just blocking there. Wow, going oh, to Moon Drive, man. Oh, he got the OTG. Yeah, that's, really what nice. I'm, that's what I'm talking about. Oh my god, he got the arm. God, in there from the I'm moon having skills. flashbacks to fucking Sorius 5U. <laughs> yeah. As the Grand Blue player, yeah, just like just TNT doing it, me, doing meaty armor, like <laughs> <Yeah>. rude, <laughs> unblockable, yeah. But DP on wake up right back from Mars, and went into the repeat. If I fight Mars, I'm mash and grab on wake up until oh, he's a hundred percent. Good conversion. Yeah, full combo. Gonna go into Nania as well. It's gonna be half life. Yeah, because he's Mars. down around, he did have four magic circuit bars to work with, too. So not out of meter, but uh, oh, man, was wrong on thinking he was going to get under to the other yeah. side. Oh, oh, my God, and he still got the hard drive. Solid yeah. damage there. Yeah, pretty solid. Wake up. Wake up. Oh, and Move nice drive. punish wow, by Mars. Yeah. Going to take game one here. You can kind of see just that, like, jump over. Saw Jinsoku go right under, and yeah. Mars is like, all right, I'm going to punish him. And Mars might have also been uh, watching the prior match. Jinsoku does favor that uh, moon skill slide mm -hmm. after moon drive just because it's safe. Yeah. No, he does. Pushing himself back towards the corner. Clash there going in Mars's favor. Yeah, the armor on that. Great. Why is there yeah, multiple hits up. of armor? <laughs> so good. <laughs> 2A, 2A? You know, I I know I said I was really enjoying this game, but unfortunately, I am going to have to stick with my law, which is if a grappler's good, the game's so good. <laughs> my, yeah, just, you can't have a good game with a good grappler. Yeah, Those two yeah. things don't work. You're a grappler and you're good. Oh, went through the armor. Still <laughs> really nice pun. It. Oh, Mars got the pick up there. Oh, quick oh overhead, yeah. God, the overhead on that. That's going to be it for that first round. Mars one round away from moving on in the loser's bracket. All right, round start throw. Oh, round start throw. <laughs> I like that because if Mars was feeling cheeky and went with the armor, it would have gotten yeah. blown up. Yeah, it would have. Uh, even on that uh, the wake up like B command grab, it has a lot of startup and can kind of get called out by just like a regular throw. Getting the stab there, the unblockable. Nice, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, no pickup from Mars. 
That's the worst feeling when there's that brief moment where you can't tell who won the air to air exchange yeah. and you think you did, <laughs> and all of a sudden you're in a combo for 4K. Yep. All right, Jinsoku, yep, access to some Mon Nania moves. Nice. Really nice shield there from the wake up heat. Yeah, nice call out. Yep. Shield BC gets a full combo. And that means uh, even though he was down around, he does get a bar back. Uh, Jinsoku, no meter at all. Zenmar's great air approach. Pushing toward the corner. Oki there. Dude, he's so he's down so long. Nice. Air throw. Okay, oh, not recovered. punished, but yeah, tried to steal a turn there. Unfortunately, yep. got caught mashing and good conversion by Mars. Air reset, gets the grab off the tech. Mars, what a great knock. Oh, oh what no! a shot! Ah, get oh my god! <laughs> Mars, oh. I can't believe it! Three times in a row, he went for the command! <laughs> oh god. I'm not playing this game anymore. Mars, <laughs> Mars, <laughs> Mars unsold me from Melty Blood. I'm good, I'm good. Thanks. Thanks, but no thanks. Mars just refunded my game. <laughs> oh, God. I have an ulcer seeing three command grabs <laughs> whipped, and he couldn't land in time to punish any of them. At all. You know, we saw we saw Jinsoku jumping three times in a row trying to call out that command grab in any shape or form, but Ooh. wow. I cannot believe Mars got that. <laughs> that didn't feel good. That did not feel good. I did not like that at all. Jinsoku, though, pretty oh solid showing for him. Going to take fifth place tonight. Mars going to move on to the winner <laughs> semis where he's going to face the winner of our next match. Going to yeah. be Backlash against uh, Macho coming yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. We're going to see Ark versus Vlav. We've seen a, a good amount of Vlav. Even last week, like you said, DPS, who won our tournament last week, our first week for Melty Blood type Lumina, as Vlav. Um, and this week, our Vlav representative is... Macho. Yeah, and DPS uh, actually not in attendance tonight, so the field is kind of open on yeah. who's going to take our uh, second week of Melty here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Button check here. Really nice to check our buttons before the match starts. And, of course, we're going to get our uh, representative for ARC in the bracket as Backlash against Macho. Vla uh, versus ARC. I know we had the mirror, which was like the only mirror that we have, but yeah, yeah, I feel yeah. like there's actually a surprisingly small amount of uh, arc representation for her being just like the effectively main character who's also very yep. good. Yep. You know, a lot of people were like, oh, this is the soul of Melty Blood type Lumina. I don't know if it's that crazy, but yeah. she's pretty good. She's still pretty good. Even, even so, Macho able to kind of assert his dominance, especially against Backlash, who's been so strong this entire tournament. Nice jump yeah, good approach. Him. Even though, it's, oh yeah, it just wins out. That button has hella clash frames. Yep. So does that TP. That's fully charged. Oh, and there's the 4BC yeah. there. Yeah. Nice showing for Macho here, taking that first round against Backlash. Yeah, I like the outfit. I think, uh... I like, I, like uh, I think Ark's actually a super cute character. I think Red Ark is slightly cuter. Big win. <laughs> yeah. I do like Red Ark a little more, but Ark, you know, has the, a lot it's of It's the, the fancy skirt, right? It's the going yeah, out skirt. Yeah. I do like and, the, and the heels, skirt. right? I like the granny it, skirt. Yeah. Yep. It's, a, it's a special occasion. Mm-hmm. Going out the projectiles, full screen. Nice block Oh, there. nice whiff oh. punish. Tried to take a turn, not quite in range. Has full meter, not gonna spend it just yet. Oh, he wasn't gonna spend it. Oh, there looking either. for the DP with the backdash there. Good patience by backlash, but unfortunately not yeah. gonna get. It. And look at that, four bars and full moon gauge. Wow, that was a, a a pretty quick game one there. Didn't even get an opportunity to pop the heat there and try to get some of that recoverable yeah, health back. Oh, fatal counter just by that jump A. What a conversion! It's a full conversion from Blob. They didn't even do that much damage. He was just really fucking cool. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's going to go into Ark's favor. I the saw the third clash, and I thought Backlash should DP it again. <laughs> oh, is that going to be it? Yeah, that goes full screen. Wow. Yeah, full okay. punish with the Ark Drive. Good yeah. damage here. Oh, but just the wake up, yep. 5A. Yep, yep. 
Wake up 5A, really good for Flub. Nice air This is block. an okay situation if Backlash can get in, and as I said it. Unfortunately not, yeah. yeah it, that was hard because Macho was out of Moon Drive, so it was the, the perfect time to come in, right, when he doesn't have that 4BC that he favors available. Yep. And going to ABC air throw. Nice. Just the, the air dash nearly at the ground there, going right into Backlash's favor, nearly getting a perfect two. Yeah, Backlash with a little bit of spaghetti there, oh. but the scramble actually mixed up Macho. Yeah. Got clipped by the overhead, baits out the DP. Oh, but no! Yeah, didn't wait long enough on the punish, and Arc floated over Vlav's head. Yeah, Backlash taking advantage of that missed punish from Macho and taking that second round. That is the yep. important lesson to learn uh, for everyone watching out there is even if you just mash, always be ready to mash. Yes, 100%. Always be ready oh. to mash 2A or 5A as much as possible. Is that going to be? Yep. Oh my god, Backlash has showed time and time again you can get that full screen, especially against a character like Flop. Yeah, counter moon drive, nice. Able to establish the pressure, oh, but unfortunately opened up. Camacho oh, sitting on a bunch of meter. Oh my god. Gonna spend one of it. Yeah. Spending two. Nice oh, IAD. The IAD. Yeah, we saw the arm say earlier the IAD is really good against this matchup for Vlob. Oh, he baits out the 4BC, but not there in time to punish. Not yeah, the worst gonna... situation. Oh, oh my oh, god! What a come out! Backlash catching the projectile. I thought he was a little early on that <laughs> arc drive, <laughs> but. I cannot believe we saw a full screen arc drive hit three times in that game. The other two were reactions, so they made sense. That one, he just was like, throw a fireball, I dare ya. <laughs> Screw it, yeah, throw a fireball. Oh, jump behind, projectile didn't cover in front enough. Backlash, gonna yep. get the first opening full here. conversion, great combo, try to backdash. No, no counter hit. No counter, yep. This time, Macho actually winning out on the crash, uh, the clash frames. He's had some bad luck uh, so far in this set with that. Yeah, I think a lot of Blob players really oh. do not like this matchup against the Arc. Fell for the charge. 2A, 2A stagger, nice. Gonna again, beat yeah. it out. And the nice, jump. yeah. Oh, man. Great timing. That's a very common trap in this game. You reverse beat just enough to be pushed out so that their counter poke will whiff, yeah. uh, or at least if you IAD, even though you're slightly minus, their crouching normals will go under it. So very oh, good call yeah. out by Backlash. Even like Backlash, he had the gall to just dash full screen yeah. into 2A. And again, getting another opening. And Macho, I mean, was really dominant early in this yep. set, but Backlash currently on set point. So much knowledge and so much adjustment for Backlash as well. Oh, not Good patience, yeah. yeah. I like that. With the amount of resources that Macho's sitting on, yeah, Moon Drive yeah, cancel. Oh, drive. Yep. he had yep. a great call out on the 4BC, but unfortunately, it, the next hit became active. Mm -hmm. yeah, gonna Macho has to be up. careful. That arc drive is lingering there. Oh, the Rekka, the Moon Drive Rekka. Oh, the that should do overhead. it straight into yeah, arc that's drive. That's gonna do it for Backlash. Taking it over Macho in this loser's bracket. That's going to be it for. Macho here, Backlash moving on. Yeah, Macho really, going out really of fifth. Great setup, yeah. All right, and that is going to take us to our winner's final. Going to have the arm coming back up. Uh, I'm trying to think of who's on the other side. I might actually have to. Oh, hey, I have the top eight here. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, that's right. The arm and bright side. Ooh, all right, all right. I, I want to see how this matchup plays out. All right, so this is going to be a three out of five. Winner going to be moving on to the winner's oh, side of Mars, grand finals. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, let's write, uh, hold on a sec. Grady, Grady, let's run uh, winner's finals first. Yep, so we're going to run, run uh, winner's finals first. That is going to be the arm versus bright side. And then we are going to run backlash versus Mars. Um, seeing some really interesting matchups here. Even so, I think that's it for uh, Vlav in this bracket. And we're just going to see some arc. We're going we have, to see some we have Koma. Akia and two arcs remaining yep. in top four. Yep. <laughs> two arcs. <laughs> oh, uh, Sleepy Night, no sabers uh, on a technicality because Jinsoku, our saber uh, from last week, was actually yep. playing Shiki this week. Yes. 
switching over from Shiki to I might Arc. even give Saber another look now that, yeah. I, now that I'm understanding the game. But Aki is so cool, man. I don't know. She's too cool, yeah. I really like the ring setup. You know, she is based a lot off of... Uh, the B and B is sick, too. The, yeah. the, the 2C, 5C, charge B into 2 and 4B. Like, yep. that combo just feels cool. I think she has a lot of, you know, interesting mobility options as well as different normals from yeah. the F Seifuku kind of... Uh, variation I, I, that I like racer that, the, uh, ACC, yeah. the air fireball as well. The startup of it sort of looks similar to the startup of her air dash. Yeah. And like you said, she has, you know, her different movement options. You can, you can do a lot of okie dokes, right? You can make it look like you're going to throw the fireball and then you, you air dash in. Yeah. Uh, her high jump uh, comes in. JB, very good normal, crosses yes. up. JC, yes. Charge JC in the air. I mean, that button. Does it gain armor? When you charge um, it, I can't remember if it does. I just know that it blows up a lot of buttons. Yeah, I think I, I don't think it gains armor. You will be able to see if it does gain armor if you charge it in the air. But at the same time, if you just jump C instead of jump charge C, you'll reach farther with the charge C than you will uh, yeah, with just, yeah. you know, the regular jump C. Yeah, so that jump charge C is so good for Akio. Yeah, like I said, we're going to see the arm versus bright side. This is going to be an Akiha. Versus Ark. Um, oh, thanks to uh, Margo for throwing some gift subs and yeah, thank uh, you very much. Yeah, getting Makoto Fox to hit us with the uh, with the host. Yes. Hope everyone's enjoying some Chicago <laughs> Melty Blood. Thank you. We're gonna have some Akiha versus yeah. Ark. The arm versus bright side. I'm I, excited. I really think this is like the only Akiha representative we have in the matchup. You know, in this like whole tournament. I think. Don't right. worry, I'll be I'll, I'll be there next time. I'll be there. Oh, next yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, all the top eight. You know, all top eight. It's gonna be like four Akias. Absolutely. Yeah. Again, yeah, we saw that jump B. Not gonna hit against Brightside. Trades two in a row. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Yo, no, okay. yeah. <laughs> the brains are connected. <laughs> they are they are one hive mind. Nice. How did we not see that in the arc mirror? Good block on the JB. Going to yeah, get tick nice, thrown yeah, here, though. Stagger that 2A oh, yeah. It doesn't even want to yeah. see what the mix-up is, but going to hold this BC yep. follow-up into the full combo using the 2-1-4-A. That is such a good follow-up. And even or, I'm so, sorry, yeah, you the 2-3-6-A. Yeah. yeah, in that uh, in that combo, you can kind of... Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah. Moon Drive, saw the fireball, able to get the TB, but again. Again. I really think that BC follow-up for Akiha is so good. Leads into a full combo. No counter, so that's default for the shield. And there's the 2C, yeah. just caught him in footsies. The arm, not able to quite finish this yet, just short of yeah. arc drive. So Ooh, that was oh a scary God. 2C. Oh, really nice use of the, the J236C. <laughs> yeah, you saw that he used the 236C in the air to jump back over and get that kind of B follow up and going into the low first round with the arm over right side. No follow up from the charge B. Yeah, pushes here. Nice dash for bright side. Full follow up there from Park. Pushing the arm back towards the corner. Great back dash from the arm. Calling out any approach from bright side in the air. Coming out the ring again. Stagger on the 2A. Gonna get interrupted from the 2 1 4 A. Nice. Rekka follow up. Going into the C. We're gonna see a setup here for bright side. Yep. The arm had a little bit of awareness there to block any sort of cross-up from bright side. Great mashup. Yeah, that's going to be uh, right out of the yeah, I would have, again, maybe like to see the back throw there, but didn't even need the corner, actually. Able to get the 2A opening. Yeah. Nice. 1-1. One, one. Both have a round. Going to block all of those air approaches from bright side. Yeah. Okay, nice. calling anything out from the arm. Yeah, good to slight delay on that pickup, making Set sure that here. Akia didn't end up too high and calls out the shield. Stayed on the same side. I think that was the first time we've seen him stay on the same side there. What, yeah. what was that? Did you see? Yeah, that was wake up moon drive into a uh, 2BC. I don't even know why that worked. Oh, he just saw that she was standing, yeah, I think. And I, I went think for the, so. yeah, 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 went for the fast low. Didn't like invuln or anything. Yep. If you did not know, the 22B, 22A from Akiha is a low. If you are blocking it high, you will get hit. Yeah, surprisingly far reaching, too. Like slightly further oh. than the animation looks. Oh, the arm losing the Clash War. So nice. No punish on the whip shield. Right, the arm running low on health. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
Clash, DP. Brightside going to take game one here again. Winner's final, though, is a three out of five match. Plenty of time to adjust back and forth. Yeah, first game going to Brightside. Winner's final. I don't know if Brightside did the DP and the first hit clashed, or if he saw Clash and just was like, yeah, time to DP. Mm -hmm. Nice full combo here from the arm. Going to DP. Yeah, set up from the hard knockdown. Good shield. Went with the yeah, nice B follow up, I think, but stayed there. I'm not actually sure what the follow up was there on the shield. Yeah, I don't think so, but yeah, Brightside taking the advantage here. Nice back dash yeah, out of the pressure. Yeah, we again, you know, the arm kind of aware, able to back dash out of the pressure from Brightside. Yeah, I have, I have to ask the arm about that later. If I, if I think what I think is happening in that setup is correct, that he's sneaking a DP in between the hits yes. of the C ring, but because it's an EX special, it's still a hard knockdown as long as it's the last hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I think it's the, the A DP as well. It comes yeah, to so make fast. it faster, yeah. yeah. Right side though, looking good. Gonna take another wow. round here. On the verge of going up 2-0. Let's see if the arm can turn the yeah. momentum around. And still for winners finals, this uh, winners final, this is three out of five as well. So good reaction with win. the throw. Oh, good block from the IED there. Yeah, nice. And the cross up 2 and 4 A. Bright side with some really clutch defense here. Yeah, the arm kind of dashed in with jump A. Wasn't able to get the fatal counter in the uh, bright side. Dashing back, putting himself in the corner. Staggering a little bit, using the moon skill ring. Yeah. I, and I think uh, the arm's adjusting a little, recognizing uh, at first the moon drive wasn't available, so it was a little bit safer to do that strength uh, ender of the C ring. Yep. And you saw the arm kind of staggering his pressure there, but right side, oh god. Oh yeah, not yeah, even a combo good. actually. He was just coming out of hit stun yep. from the 6BC and yep. got clipped. The arm spending a lot of moon gauge on the 6BC, the, yeah. the fireball there, just to extend the pressure. Uh, because of that, didn't have moon drive available. It hasn't really run into a situation where he's needed it. Yeah, but bright side, that IADC into a full conversion, pushing the oh, arm back himself towards in the, the corner. corner to, yeah. oh, oh, and the crowd no. shield's going to get the punish. Big combo here. Yep. Dunk. Wake up heat. Yeah, gonna get a good chunk of the health from that last combo chunk back. Health. Yeah, pausing the uh, the timer as well. No follow up from the low. Oh, and just caught yeah, him with the two it. and four A. Oh no. Air tech's out though. Moon drive back at you, and yeah. sees it. Gets the DP. <laughs> oh, okay. nice. Oh, no punish there. Oh, yeah, that was the yeah. moon skill version. Yep. Going into arc drive, 2-0 over the arm. Let's see how uh, he handles this kind of, you know, 2-0 over. Uh, yeah, I mean, I feel like uh, the arm is getting a lot of kind of the hits that he needs, yeah. but uh, Brightside's just sort of clutching out the right spots to mash out, right? He's finding yes. the spots to reversal. He's making the DPs count to get out of pressure. And really even that one that got baited, well, yeah. it was the moon scale version. He was able to get away with it. Just seeing a lot of air. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No kind of an awkward spot to catch that counter hit JA in the yep. air. Yeah, going to the 60, throwing out the ring. Yeah, actually just checking down to the A ring there, not even spending the moon drive this time. Oh, yeah. And then there's that. Yeah, yeah. Brightside's actually just making some clutch blocks as well. He's so patient, especially with a lot of that uh, approach that the armor is giving him. Oh, empty jump into throw, and Ark is one of those characters that can combo fully off of her throw. Okay, this is going to be a real hit. Counter. Yep. Hard knockdown. What's he going to do? Yeah, B ring. Oh, oh able to get the yeah, falling nice jig really nice. Got to be careful with the cancel pressure. Yeah, three BC. Able to get out of the situation for the Fatal moment. Counter. And the arm. Actually, not in the worst spot. There is Moon Drive, Bright Side. Let's see if he's going to use it. Not quite yet, but he is low on meter. Yeah, interesting oh, crash the punish right on the shield, though. Actually, it wasn't even a punish. He just caught the grab. Mm -hmm. And it, it is match point for Bright Side yeah, to move grabs, to the uh, winner's side. Of grabs work really interesting in this game. If you grab from a little far away, they do a little run up. Yeah, similar to BB Tag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No backdash from the jump. Seat. Nice awareness from the arm just to grab, putting uh, Bryce head toward the corner. Thankfully, not similar to BB Tag, is if you do Street Fighter throw in Melty, it is a throw. In BB Tag, it's DP, and mixing those two up is very rough. I can tell you that from experience. 
Oh, oh catches the back dash. Yeah. Starting the mute skill. Again, throwing it out. Oh, caught the two A, but didn't mash out fast enough. Yeah, Whoa, fast, fast overhead enough. though. IDJB and yeah, the arm nice. staying alive for the time being. Etching his way out for the second round. Oh, the ID wow. was co the correct read, but just went too far. Oh, it's, it held shield a little too long. I think he would have been able to get a follow up there. Nice. Well, yeah, that was a funky rebeat. round. Yeah, yeah. That was a rebeat. Into the. Nice. He just did the 5A trying to be safe, but it worked as a conversion. Oh, full combo punish from the arm. Oh, wait. I think he would have been able to combo. Oh, and, and I there, think actually this grab would have comboed off the ring, too. Yeah. And the arm staying alive, putting the game up. I think the arm, if he didn't, you know, go right into the DP for the hard knockdown, he would have been able to combo into a lot of the meter that he had for that round. Just going into the grab, nice, yeah, simple B and B from Akita. Good stagger there, yep. two A into nice. delay two A. Hard knockdown, puts out the B ring, looking for the shield, yes. stuffs the DP. Good yes. pickup with the two C six C, but Arc a little high in the air, kind of fell out of that combo in the corner. Low profiles with the 2C, but unfortunately too much recovery. Still gets whiff punish for it. Yeah, the right side kind of changing this, but wake up DP from the arm. And caught the grab, correct, on the read. And yeah. the arm has some momentum going three straight rounds. The arm really does, like you said. He, uh, oh, this is a big hit too. 2C, wow. good starter, but uh, maybe went for the uh, the two uh, uh, two three six A and just didn't get the jump yeah, cancel there. I think he might have just dropped that uh, that full combo there. Okay. Yeah, this going time going with again. the charge JC follow up. Good shield back oh. and the grab. Shield back just in the grab. Blood heat. Right side getting a lot of this, a lot of this health back. Yeah, and the arm. I like that. Just run away till the blood yeah, heat's yeah, gone yeah, because. Yeah. It's not only the threat of Last Arc on shield. She also has the full screen uh, arc drive that can punish, you know, a bad ring toss or things like that. Especially if she's just, you know, standing on the ground and Akiha is in the air, she can kind of throw it out. Good there, shield, but, uh, and he's yeah, going to get the yeah, landing nice punish. Full combo there. Ring. And the grab the cheap stuff, yep. yeah. Oh, right side just holding backwards and the arm taking advantage of that. And wow, he's. Kind of seeing a comeback here. Yeah, the 236B on the ground. Uh, he likes that on the ground because you have to stand shield it. Uh, if yeah. you try to, to go for the crouching shield to protect from the 2A, then that grab becomes real that he went for. Yeah. Hiddle counter, no uh, no follow up there. Wow, bright side. Yeah, nice punish from the, uh, the landing frames on the ring. Oh, that was so late. Was so nice, too. Good cool conversion, conversion as well, yeah. Oh, calls out the shield. Doesn't oh, get the no, combo, no, though. Oh, I think they both two-seated each other. Arcs just one out. Yeah, mashing 2A there. Trying to call out any kind of wake-up. What a shield on the IAD. Great reaction. And Brightside back to match point. Yeah, seriously, wow. Trying his best to stay alive from the arms comeback. Oh, and he catches the 2A at round start. Wow, this is yeah, very good for him. Sick. Nice dunk. Going into the rebeat. Oh, wow. And the wall bounce. Nice. Oh, no. Use no reaction. Oh, and perfect timing on the IED. Things are starting to look a little bleak for the arm here. Is going to cash out the arc drive? No. Just going to no, do the C. Not. Just going to go into the uh, EX move. Yeah. Nice. Blows up wow, the stand shield so with, two, with the down BC. Oh, oh no. Yeah. Wow. That's going to do it. Bright side moving to the winner's side of grand finals. Yeah, yep. and uh, I think the arm trying his best to make a little bit of a flashy comeback with that run up uh, blood heat. Yeah, got called out by uh, Bright side, low shielding, punished fully, and Bright side moving on to grand final. That's uh, gonna set up our loser semis. Yep. Gonna be backlash coming up against Mars. So another arc remaining in the bracket. We have one arc left. Yeah, we have an now arc. Now we have a bright test uh, in, in winners. So we have one in winners side of grand finals. We have uh, backlash with the arc here in the loser semis. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ooh. Oh, Mars thought he was playing Macho. He, he didn't see the results <laughs> of the last uh, <laughs> of the last match. Yeah. 
Yeah, backlash. You know what yeah. they say, you if you assume you make an ass out of mm. Umeharu. <laughs> Uh, thank you so much again for tuning in to some great melty action here in Chicago. Um, we are nearly at our finale here, but we have our loser semis and then finals, and then we have our grand finals left. But again, just want to say thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, like you said, we have Ark versus Coma. It is going to be Mars versus Backlash. Uh, two Arcs left in this bracket, and we have an Akiha as well as a Coma left. Uh, yeah, some interesting matchups for sure. Service. Open your magic circuit. Oh, nice jab. No fatal counter. Yeah, good patience by Mars, not pushing a button around start, but this is a fatal counter. Oh yep. my god, how is that so much damage already? What is all that damage? Wait, what? What was the first hit? That's Maybe like this is just, just JC, right? Yeah. yeah. Seriously. But it was like that, like three hits into the combo. What a start from Mars taking so much life off of Ark. Oh, okay, great. Yeah, great interruption with 2A, 2B, 2C. Full conversion from Backlash, putting Mars in the corner. Trying to stuff any options on Wake Up from Mars, and that's going to do it for the first round. Backlash over Mars. One round. Putting in a really, really good position. Oh man, I really, really do love the, the just walk up. Yeah. yeah. Mars very confident approaches in general in most yep. games. But Backlash still able to assert his dominance. Yeah, good patience, not falling for the charge normal there. Yeah. ABC grab. I think that Backlash might have been just going for the, the empty meaty 2A and the uh, landing recovery yep. after the air dash made him not get his oh, normal. Oh man, the jump chart C. Putting him in completely in favor. Oh, Ooh, okay. The Stuff's arm. happening. I don't know. There's, there's. I don't know what's happening. Oh, this is gonna be a punish? No. No, no. That was moon drive. Command grab though. Back into the corner. Mars sitting on all kinds of meter here. Oh, oh no. Nice pick up yeah. off the five. Hey. Oh no. It was a great beat. Okay. Yes. I was about to say that was a weird juggle. Oh, what an empty jump into the 2-2-A. Two, 2-A, two, 2-A. Two, two, and if you're Backlash, you have to finish this round right now. Yes. You, there's so much meter. Moon Drive, DP, oh, yes. Yeah, 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 Great yeah. reaction. Backlash going to take game one here. Uh, the Clash frames on that, uh, that dunk from And Coma. keep in mind, our loser semifinal is only a two out of three. Yeah. Dashing in, trying to call out with that 2A, but still gets hit by Backlash. Yeah, I think he just got cl clipped low. Uh, yep. Just was stand blocking. Scoops, yep. Nice scoop. Charge a little bit. Damn, that command grab said invincibility, not armor. I don't know about this. Again with the moon skill DP. Yeah, follow up there from the moon skill armor. Oh, the Clash is going to go into Backlash's favor. No punish on the Wake of Heat. Okay, he's going to... No, he's not going to spend his full meter. He has. Yeah, okay. DP's out. Late Air Dash wasn't very real. Why did yeah. that 2A anti-air there? It anti-aired, but no fatal counter either. Oh, the armor from Mars. Yeah, this that's going to take it. it. Yep. Yep. All right, Mars putting up the first round in game two here. Magic Circuit. Yeah, see him jumping, kind of non-charging the Z. Wow. I got the OTG as well. Hit by the wake of DP. Nice. Got what great movement. Backlash getting under right as Mars landed. Nearly unseeable. Mm -hmm. Side switch into the 2A, but you don't got to see it to DP it. Yeah, DP on wake up from both these players doing really well for them. Nice. Air grab. Oh, great setup. Did the air backdash to try to get the side switch Ooh. mix up? Yeah, he tried to get the, the C command grab and it didn't work, but was still able to get the armor too. Mars. Not gonna catch. Yeah, gonna whiff the. Oh, no. Backlash though. Dropping the punish. Okay, able to recollect another hit here. Yeah, gonna spin the arc super. drive. Oh! Eh, yeah, it doesn't really It was during the super, yeah, it doesn't affect anything. Yeah, it doesn't really We're not taking it that seriously. Yeah approach. 
Yeah, great. if it doesn't dude. affect gameplay, it's yeah. whatever. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> if it was like in the middle of Mars's combo, it would have been like, yeah, right, yeah we gotta yeah, give yeah. that round up. Why is he still oh, in armor? In the armor? What? Oh, Did he have armor in the recovery? Yes, he does. He does. Why does he still have armor in the recovery of the move on Whiff? Tutu, he has so much armor for Kama, using it to his advantage. Oh, backlash. Okay, set up, DP'd. Backlash out of there. It is set point for backlash. Nice shield. Oh, it tricked him. Yep. Doesn't have the meter finish off this round. All right, gonna get some recoverable health back. Yep. Backlash, I feel like he went in a little early. You might want to get some of that health back first. Arc drive, good block by Mars. Yeah, a little late on the punch. Oh my god, though. Yeah, a little late on the punch, like you said, but uh, Mars is take the round, yeah. Wow, what a game. I can't get over that armor. What? Yes. So if Koma is able to activate 2 c he has armor for days until it runs out, right? And even if you jab, like jab, 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 2A, 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 you're still going to get That's hit by Koma. That's fine, but that should be during startup, not recovery. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nice, charges up a little bit. Mars able to use his momentum oh, to have what his life lead here. Yeah, really nice. Able to get the OTG, dash in. Oh, the instant air dash D. Yeah, backlash in yeah. a rough situation. Moon drive is available. A lot of and yeah, wake meter up, available. Yeah, why not do an invincible yeah, wake not? up command yeah, grab? And nice anti air reaction. Yeah, DP as well. Now, why not DP? Yeah, why not? Dash in, air dashing as well. Seeing oh. him charge that. <laughs> Good wait. Good recognition of the fatal. Yep. ABC dunk going just for the Okia. Nice. That was a, a funky hit with the jump back. I think that he still had plus frames there. Oh. Gonna get scooped here though. Yeah, nice scoop on the landing frames. Oh, baited it out. Doesn't get the punish, but does get back to the corner. But unfortunately, gonna get fatal tier. Good pick up by Mars. Solid yeah. damage. Oh, OTG. really nice. Okay. I think he used that OTG to try and get health back. Getting a lot of health back. Come here, grab. Oh, he's no gonna punish. Oh, no. Oh, that should do it. Yeah, Mars oh. going to take it. Mars. Great adjustments there in the second game and then able to take it out over Backlash. The only remaining arc player we have in this tournament is going to be sitting in grand finals, our bright side himself. But uh, yeah, really great showing from Backlash. Um, you know. Uh, Mars staying on, it's going to face the arm, which is an uphill battle. Wow. Yeah. Great stuff from uh, Backrush here. Mars moving on and loses bracket. We have the arm versus Mars. It's going to be Akiha versus uh, Koma. Uh, a matchup I... <laughs> I've definitely played before, but with uh, someone who wasn't too knowledgeable in the Coma matchup. Yeah, this was uh, a, a yeah. run back of our winner semi as well. Yeah. Uh, Mars uh, was looking really good early on, but the arm was able to edge that out two to yes. one, but it was actually a very close set. This time it is going to be a three out of five. Mm -hmm. Yeah, three out of five for our losers finals. Akiha versus Coma. Uh, good to see some more. Uh, entrance. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Damn, I was trying to get my jam on. <sighs> Destiny's Entrance, definitely my favorite song yeah, in the game. So good. It's such a good song, yeah. Also, you're just brawling in a back alley to a very good song. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this, uh, <laughs> this stage in Aki's favor. We're going back to the mansion. Yeah. Nice start for Mars, getting the air grab set up here. Oh, oh what a wow. oh, shield. Oh, double overhead. It, yeah, using the JB, JA, very fast. That JA actually much faster. You, it seems like she's too low to the ground, uh, but she actually can definitely get that second overhead. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And the arm, yeah, great air. There you go. And yeah, you, you can see right there the adjustment. He tried the B ring, Oki, and got DP'd out of it. And then the next setup, he did the A ring, which will move Akiha backwards out of DP range. Yeah, and we saw the arm as well canceling 214A into Moon Drive. 
but uh, Mars picking it up, able to take that first round. Yeah, and unfortunately, uh, Akia does have some really solid hit confirms, but there's a pretty big damage disparity between these two characters. Woo! Yeah, that charge C is so good for Akiha. Beats out. Oh, I think he tried to 2 3 6 C and got oh, his okay. input crossed up and it got the uh, 2 and 4 C instead. Alright. Yeah. Getting out of there. Mars burning resources. Oh, nice punish though on the shield. Yeah, I think the Arn trying to call out any mash 5A from uh, Mars. Mars aware of that. Oh, Pushing duff. the Arn towards the corner. Yeah. For the command grab. Yeah, he's on the ground. Oh, the so forward tech from Mars right back. Oh, in. he went for the arc drive. What a weird interaction. So her super, the arc drive also is a command grab, but it is, it's like a strike grab. It's very weird. Uh, but it actually only the strike part hit, not the capture. Throwing out the this ring. Is an, oh, good shield. Oh, nice okay. shield. Yeah, the arm aware of that. Yeah, Gonna that was a little round. scary, not being able to get the enough damage yep. off that C ring, not able to get that DP in. Oh, good delay. Going to get the pickup here from the Fatal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's on the ground for so long. He's able to charge up and still get Oki as well. This damage, oh my goodness. Look at this damage, yeah, he's like, yeah, nice. Unblockable. Oh, air recovered throw. from the JA yeah. whip in time to get another overhead with the JB. He's gonna go into the air throw, air throwing out the A ring. All right, clashes. Yeah, clash there. Good Not block. Yep. No yeah. third, uh, third sequence of the Rekka, only a high. Oh, we got the rejump combo, but no follow-up. Throwing out a DP. Oh, okay. Yeah, shields the activation. Hey, Mars did still it. get the activation, but this is going to whip. Nice yes. air backdash for the, the punish. Arm, the arm knows. Absolutely. Coma goes forward. Yes. Trying to command grab you in your arc drive. And the forward jump also was a little floaty. She wouldn't have landed in time to punish. So really, really heads up awareness there with Absolutely. the air backdash. Gets back in time to punish. Yep, the arm up one game against Mars. Oh, what an IADP. Going right into the throw, throwing out the B ring. Pushing her a little more towards, but Mars, oh, wow. great grab. Yeah, tick grab in the middle of the pressure. Charge B, wow! Oh, that was Charge C, actually. Yeah, pick up there. TPs, safe jump. Safe jump, yeah, yeah really, really nice. A lot of damage from Mars' side. Oh, oh my caught, god! Caught the landing recovery punish. Yeah, that Charge 2C just caught the landing there from the arm. Well, combo, gonna go into the DP, yep. Dash up setup. Oh! oh. Was, had sort of the right read, but the wrong RPS. Whoa! Yeah, oh my god, Both what an drive spent. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be Oh, it, you like yeah. grabs? Okay. You like armor? I'll just grab you right back. Oh, wow, yeah. he tanked all of that. Still able to get the advantage. There's the charge C again, yeah. Nice. Yes, yeah, uh, Arc Drive, is he gonna spend it? Yeah, this should close out the round. Yep, Mars is gonna take it. game two here. That should be it. Wow, clapping yeah. a little bit. Yeah, yeah feeling Mars himself popping off bit. for himself here. Kind of feeling that pressure from Akiha. A lot of players kind of not wanting to deal with a lot of the ring setups and everything. Oh! <laughs> okay, gets the BC yeah. follow up on the shield. And you see, he kind of went into 2GC, and Akiha, uh, the arm was able to negate everything. Nice. And 6C, nice. Side switches the here, the arm in the corner, but out. able to keep the pressure up. Oh, I was about to say that Mars is like swinging, but just not finding the ranges to connect. Akia just kept barely getting out of the way, but Moon Drive able to get the DP in. Yeah, nice. Yeah, the arm able to use that air mobility to mix up his approach options. Okay, Mars grabbing it towards the corner. Oh my god, they're both shield. They're both heating on wake up. Oh, stuff is happening. Oh, oh god, command grab. Scooped up by Mars. Going to do a good chunk of damage. Oh my god. Using the armored move to take that round. Wow, really nice stuff from Mars. Oh, oh, round start man. air grab. Yeah, Mars is feeling himself a little bit. 
And he's that type of player. When, when he really gets in the zone, he's very difficult to slow down. Oh, oh wow. yeah! Just gliding Dude, through the air. Nice grab, setting up Oki in the corner. Oh, the charge jump C, full conversion. So much damage. Okay, yeah, he's gonna... Oh, run up, command grab, but a little too far. Yep. And Mars has a full punish. That is gonna be 2-1 in favor of Mars. One game away from going to grand finals. Mars really showing some good stuff in this matchup. Like a lot of good awareness too. Okay. Yeah, we've seen that a few times. Just empty shield on the jump in. Mars sort of forced to shield back in order to engage in the RPS, and then the arm just recovers and grabs him. Going right into the grab, setting up the B ring. Staggered on the 2A, really, really nice. Again, going into DP. Oh, he used the moon skill one, and I just made things kind of funky there. Yeah, it wasn't a hard knockdown. You'd mentioned maybe it's just the slower startup on the 3 BC compared to the normal uh, mm -hmm. DP. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, I like the empty IAD from Mars calling out the shield that the arm's been doing, but the arm just sort of read it. Still kind of got caught there, too. Yeah, nice mash on the 2A, 2A. One round up, the arm not out of it just yet. Arm trying his best, going into the Akiha B and B set up on the A ring. Okay, nice. Ew! Shields the DP, yeah, gonna get the full bonus here. Yeah, his air approach, he opted for the shield instead because he knew he was, you know, Mars. Oh, the wake Clash, up. it has armor and Clash frames, does it all. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, the arm opting for the jump out. Nice. Only Mars has one bar to spend. Sort of kicking himself there, I, I think. Oh, that's gonna wow. hit. Okay, that's gonna hit. Not gonna drive. Do, yeah, not gonna do a bunch of damage. The arm's still sitting on moon drive here. He's gonna activate. Oh, try to get the three BC anti-air. Wow, the response to the four BC. Yeah, and Mars turning the tide in his favor, able to stop the clock, able to get some more. Good block on the high. Oh, no, but wrong on the shield, and Mars is on set point. Yeah, I think we've seen uh, the arm kind of high shielding a little more often than he should be kind of low shielding against the coma. Nice. Full combo. DP, set up the B ring. Yep, scoop. Yep. <laughs> oh, no, wake up, command grab. Oh, the back dash baits out the heat, but doesn't actually get the punish on the activation. Yeah, yeah, the strike yeah. is still there. You gotta shield the strike even if you backdash the grab. Oh, yes, and he was able to catch any approach from Mars, and that is going to take it for our fourth game here. <laughs> One game away from both of these players. Wow, really, really nice adjustments from the arm. Wow. I'm gonna take a lot of the stuff into this matchup, for sure. Oh, the cross on JC? <laughs> It's really, really good, especially wow, as a cross early up. moon drive in neutral from Mars, and he gets oh, stuffed oh, 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 out. Oh, that was sick. Oh my god, he got a full combo from Yeah, him. and that was a good starter. Hella damage there. Yeah, oh, nice you? back off. Let him let him eat it with the armor. Mars took a ton of damage armoring cannot, that fireball. Yeah, I cannot believe how this round is starting right now. Oh, oh what do two A anti air? So that wasn't a fluke earlier when we saw Kuma two A anti air. Oh my something. god! Yeah, he tried to moon drive out of it, and still got caught by the command grab. Set up here for the Mars. Is he calling in the Mars? <laughs> oh, yeah. just armors through, and again, I Mars. I think the arm tried a 2BC. You know, it has a little bit of armor, but Mars, yeah, aware of that. It will take that first round against the arm. Oh, no, I think he tried to, I think he thought that Mars was gonna pass over his head and he mm. would get the punish mm. with the 5C. Yeah. Oh, 6C though, big boo. This is a good starter. Oh no, that's in combo though, a little too high in the yeah. air. Yeah, I think the arm tried to catch him in the air, blocking the ring and get the- uh, Yeah, the get an yeah. unblockable setup or something. Not big damage here for Mars though. Oh, just moon drive 2A and that might do it. No, no not, not gonna quite. be enough. Gonna yeah, get some heat, life. Get that life back. Oh, oh good patience. Yes, Mars. Arm. 
Waiting out the shield, able to get the punish. Yeah, saw the arm catching, uh, you know, kind of holding that shield and uh, Mars pausing any, you know, approach that he had against him and uh, able to get it out there. Yeah, really nice. That was so, so close though, the arm trying any sort of comeback against him. Um, but yeah, really nice stuff from Mars. Moving on to grand finals against Brightside. I love the winners. Uh, like the post round OST is really good. Very chill, yeah. yeah. All right, bright side. Going to be coming in on the winner side here yep. in grand finals. Yep. Uh, only needs to win one three out of five set to take the tournament. Mm -hmm. Mars going to have to win a three out of five to bring bright side down to the lower side of the bracket with him and then another to take it. So Yeah, and even with the beginning kind of stages of this game, even though it's, you know, two weeks into the game, we have Arc versus Coma. Seems like it's going to be in Arc's favor. You know, it, Koma definitely seems like one of the, uh, not mechanically uh, similar to Armika, but one of those characters where, like, sometimes matchups go out the window when they yeah. touch you, right? Yeah. Yeah, like I said, gonna see Ark versus Koma. Mars gonna be Koma. Ark is, uh, you know, Bryce is gonna be Ark. Going right into it, this is our grand finals for our second week for Melty Blood Type Lumina. Oh, both players zoom in at the start. <laughs> yeah. Mars catching the 2A, not ready to combo. Yeah, nice back dash from the yeah. right side. Oh, just caught in the air though. Forward text. Whoa. Oh my god. Was that oh. a rapid beat off the whiff? <laughs> yeah, I think so. And he just got caught by it. Right, there's the empty 2A. Yeah, we see that saw the counter hit. Again, yeah. Mars might be testing the water on that setup. Oh, I think he blocked the first hit of that armored kind of moon drive. I think he was, uh, I think Brightside was trying to call out activation uh, and try to stand shield. Mm -hmm. Nice. Well, counter activation. Oh, this is unfortunate for Brightside. Yeah, not going to be enough to kill there, but enough to set up. And the scoop. Oh. God, yeah, Mars, nice approach. First round going to him. See what Brightside has as a counter back. Back dash, yeah, nice back dash away from any charge, uh, charge normal from Koma. Good back dash, get yeah, another nice pressure. Back again. Oh, fatal, fatal counter, but he got yeah. two hits in the air, yep. so the fatal was already spent by the second hit. Yep. Oh, okay, both shielding, but Brightside taking his advantage. And Brightside, you can see he was a little bit late on the punish attempt. Mm -hmm. He might have actually specifically just saw what the arm was doing against that, and it was like, sure, I'll try that. Mm -hmm. Brightside getting that, TP on wake up, both. Okay, we see uh, both kind of running out of meter there, but Brightside still has two bars. Oh no, but Koma too high up in the air, falls out of the combo. Yep. Little bit of an insurmountable oh, comeback yeah, from Mars. Was far. Okay, just gonna activate Heat. Got oh, him. got him, yeah, that's gonna do it. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Mars kind of taking that in spectacular fashion. And Mars, uh, I mean, just kind of spending the cash as soon as he could get yeah. it. He's, I think he activated Heat three times in that round. Yeah, why not? Just spend the cash, especially if you're going into Heat. Just spend it. Why not? Oh, great dash up 2A from Bikeslide. Okay, not going to go forward. Wow, what a dash and C. DC. Oh, runs into a DP. Yeah. Oh my god, it was on the same side. Dash in for Brightside. Oh my god, where am I going? Very quick round. Brightside right back in it. What side am I on? Oh no, my god, that was sick. Okay, yeah, going right through the armor with the EX move. Okay, yeah, calling out the shield for command grab. Back Good back dash. dash. Yeah, gonna get the punish here. And Mars about out of resources. He made the input come out the wrong direction. Yeah, gonna get great another punish here. Right side. Scoop yeah. and the combo off the grab. 
Arc, one of those characters able to combo off her, off her grab. A um, couple other characters are Miyako, as well as Red Arc as well. Also able to combo off the grab. Uh, Brightside utilizing that to his advantage, taking that second game. Arc's just Mars. standing there <laughs> yeah. in the pre-round movement. Ops to not actually do anything. Gonna get his landing recovery clipped nice. here. Yeah, ABC. Going low, caught Brightside high shielding. Coming again, charge up. Great dash back, no punish there. Yeah, saw the clash. Dunk again. Oh, back dash trying to bait out the DP, but I'm Mars with a good call out with the rush punch there. Yeah, Mars kind of see Brightside back, back dash a little too much. It was like, all right, I'm going to call you out for it. Oh, hey, oh, oh, what the hell was yeah, that? Yeah, Mars just kind of standing there, got dunked. Oh, nice mash on the 2A. Maybe one for the Okie doke make him think your controller's broken, and then mash 2A <laughs> yeah. on wake up. Yeah. Oh, big ID. Yeah, and so Mars going to close yeah. out the round here. Really nice. Okay, getting that extra bar. Bright side still has a little bit of advantage, even though he's down around. Too far for that, yeah. I think that he was expecting a follow up from Bright side to bring him into range. Right side just is so good against like what side am I going, where am I going high or low? Good activation, yeah. It was pretty recognizable yeah. that Bright Side was not there in time for the punish. Oh no, he got the he got the jump out, but, yeah, still but didn't get the follow-up. That's fine. I mean, you bled all his resources, right? He barely has enough yeah. moon gauge to activate moon drive. I mean, it's gonna be a very uphill battle in this round four Mars, but fatal counter is a good start. What was that? What a weird I reset. Yeah, that was really weird. Oh, yeah, gonna go into heat. Brightside out of there. No fatal counter, yeah, so no not able counter. to get the combo. And Brightside's just scooting around with the moon skill. He's got four bars here, too. Ooh, the jump cancelable DP. Oh, one time too many. Mars oh, no. doesn't have the whole no confirm, and that's gonna be a fatal. A little bit of a scrambly yeah, combo. I think he used the. The oh. IAD whipped! She low profiled it. Low profile, caught the landing frames there from Mars. Gonna take the, yeah, one game apiece, one round apiece. Throwing him back towards the corner. Oh, shot. Superman punch. Yeah, that was a fatal counter, but no follow up from Mars. Yeah, bright side, nice. Use of the mobility there to get out, yep. Mars using his armor. Oh, that's why. Yes, that he activates gives him armor. An, yep. Yeah, and the armor stays. That's why he still had armor and recovery the one time. Yep. Okay. Yep. It's like a an armor mode. Yes. Yes. That's fucked up. <laughs> yeah. It's one of the good things that Koma has. Yeah, for sure. Charging a little bit. Great back dash. No punish. Oh, try to frame trap with the moon skill TP. No bite from Mars. Oh, fatal counter. Oh, no full follow up from Mars. Okay, and that's our third game yeah. going to Mars. Amadeus, yeah. he might have like Izanami ribcage actually. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah. So his uh his two two C, um with the two two B you get like a like a combo follow up with the two two C he's in like an armor mode for a set amount of time. Um, so you see him like glowing red, flashing red and orange. Whoever made this character needs to be banned from the genre. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Ooh, that was scary, yeah. Oh yeah, able to get out of that command grab. Going low! ABC follow-up. On the other side, went low, but Mars able to call it out. Command grab, has enough time to charge up two! Ooh, and just waits it out. Didn't even counter shield, gets the two L there. Yep. Jump oh. out. No, I like that actually, get out of the corner first. Yeah, yeah, I, I do like that as well. Yeah, because even know. if he got that punish, he was going to get like an okay combo, maybe, and be mid-screen. Mm -hmm. And wow, yeah, he was able to get the empty jump into the grab, closing out that round. Uh, Brightside fighting his way back, uh, trying not to get reset by Mars. Oh, look at the damage on that. Oh, my God. Oh, oh there goes your moon drive. Yeah, I like that. Do the moon drive DP. I don't yeah, even yeah. think her moon drive DP is in vuln. It's just jump cancelable yeah, if, it's, jump if you're wrong. Yeah, and it's yeah, pretty yeah. fast startup. You're kind of guessing on like wake up and DP, like DP on wake up like that. But ah, oh, okay, nice punish there from Mars. One round away from resetting the bracket. Nice dashes. Yeah, we see Brightside using that uh that jump beat. 
so good. Mm. Charging up. Going into Blood Heat. Mars trying his best not to press a button. Is he going to go into Super Hero? Yes. That's going to be a good chunk. Might be near half health. Going to be like 60%, I think. Oh, yeah. The reach of CC going right into the low. Bright side. Nice use. Oh, oh put no. himself in the corner. This is scary. And it is reset point for Mars. Yep. Blood Heat there, too. If he shielded that wake up heat from bright side, he would have gotten the uh, he would have gotten the last arc. I like oh. the, uh, I really like to run away during the blood heat. Yeah. Like don't even engage. Not Ooh. worth it at all. Okay, gonna bright side up. nice. Gonna give bright side a slight lead here. Try to chase the back dash. Not quite there, but the frame trap works out, and he catches yeah. the meaty, and okay, it's gonna okay, be two okay. to two here in our first set. Yeah, bright side. Wow, yeah, fighting his way back two to two. Mars one game away from resetting the bracket. Brightside one game away from closing it out, finishing it here in Grand Finals. Really, really nice stuff from both of these players. Yeah, using that jump charge C. Oh, trying to chase anything out for Brightside. Yeah, nice confirm there on the low. A, B, C, grab. Got the rejump. Back dash from Mars. Okay, call them out. It's gonna be a good amount of damage. Wake up, yeah, backdash again. We saw no follow-up from the backdashes from those uh, wake up C command grabs. Okay, again, what a shield for Mars. Got a little bit of the call out. Okay, full combo here. Not gonna be enough. Just oh, yet. and that tech trap air grab. Nice call out, Mars back to reset point. Oh yeah, Mars just like, all right, you're jumping back, right? I'm gonna the jump back, JC. Able to get the fatal, starting with a solid 30% yeah, here. Right side not in a good spot. Does not want this bracket reset. And there's at the all. overhead. And he is at full. Oh, uh -oh. no! That's bad. Whoa, just wake up 5A though. Right side not out of this yet. Dunk. Scoop. The scoop ran out. Caught of the heat. back dash with the 2C. Bright side running low on resources, but not out of it. Yeah, we saw Brightside hit that armor, and Mars kind of went to the other side. This is, is not going to be it just gonna be close. Yeah. Brightside has meter. He can't activate Moon Drive. Ugh. But Mars using the armor on that 2-2-B and going to reset the bracket. Uh, it is <laughs> really, really good stuff from both of these players. Wow. Right side, head back to character select just for a quick break. Yep. Very, very quick break. <laughs> yeah, reset on the bracket. We are going back to zero for both of them. Uh, Marsh showing really, really nice knowledge. Really nice uh, adaptation against Arc. Brightside hanging in there, though. I mean, Mars yeah, was up very sure. heavily early in that first set, and Brightside did claw it almost all the way back. Yeah, he almost came all the way back. Oh! Holding high shield, no punish. Oh, tried to get the fast air to air. No bite. Oh, and able to get the combo on the other side. Going back towards the corner. Air recovery. Nice. Yep, full combo there from bright side. Bates up the DP, not able to get there in time to punish. Yeah, not, not a big punish there at all. Oh! Yeah, don't, no, I was about to say, do not stand in front of Mars like that. Okay. Oh yeah, the armor, yeah. Hitting the armor, not gonna get a follow up. Oh, trying to back dash again. Get away from any pressure from Mars. Okay, just runs up and does the moon skill DP. Yeah. I'd be not surprised to see him do it again. Oh, was that a punish on the heat? You know, I'm not sure. It, it was very close. Yeah. It looks really close, yeah, but uh, Brightside taking that first round on the bracket reset. I think that he caught him just trying to get away. I yeah, think he might I have been so, holding yeah, up back yeah. or something. Oh, scary clash. Oh, nice pickup from the IADC. All right. Empty land into the grab. Backdash looking for the DP. 
Wow, that is the fastest two-way mash I've ever so seen. So good, yeah, going right in Mars' favor, pushing Bright Side back towards the corner. I'm amazed that Mars didn't accidentally get auto combo launch. <laughs> yeah, for real. Dunk. Got the setup, empty jump low, really nice from Bright Side. See it again, no, back dash, forward. Good reverse beat, yeah, backing out of there. Armors, go great launch on the shield. Yeah, really nice. And a pretty clean game here, the first game of the reset, that was looking a lot better for Brightside than actually the last couple of games, because even the ones he was winning, he was sort of scraping out, where this one he had pretty good control for most of it. Yeah, he took that, uh, that like, five-second reset, going back to character select to compose himself a little bit and uh, take that first game in really nice fashion. Nice. See the setup here. Going on the other side, of course. Once again, utilizing that neutral jump into the low. Yeah. Wake up, DP. Nice tech out of it. Oh! Yeah, Mars not able to handle a lot of the follow ups there from right side. On the same side again. Yeah, got caught mashing 2A. Good back dash, but they tried to moon skill DP and yeah. good avoidance there by Mars. Oh, oh, but too much avoidance there. <laughs> yeah, got caught in the back dash there from Brightside. One, yeah. One round up. Early heat activation just to get out of the pressure. Yeah, get out of the pressure. Not going to gain any life back either, but uh, there goes all his meter for. You know, this beginning part of the round. Yeah, but that did like 20% off that random <laughs> hit. Yeah. All right, gets the punish on the landing recovery. Nice. Oh. Doesn't get the full combo, but able to catch a reset here. I'm gonna see him go to the other side. Yep. Oh, interrupted from anything following that 2A. Yeah, nice command grab, got a little charge. Back dash. Caught the back dash, yeah, good yep. choice with the moon skill here. No, oh, too far to punish. Yeah, too far to punish, even though he wasted all of that meter. Yeah, I mean, getting the resources out, especially being up around right now, that was still kind of a W for Brightside. Yeah. As long as Brightside doesn't, like, run into a counter hit JC uh, right now, he's in okay shape. Significant mm -hmm. meter advantage. Our drive? Be it? Yes. I believe so, yeah. Should be enough. Yep. Yeah, gonna go right from the Rekka into the Arc Drive. Gonna take the second game. Wow, Brightside taking some serious adjustments to get this advantage here. Yeah, and again, uh, we just like I said last game, right? That was a clean game for Brightside. Like he was just pretty firmly in control the whole time. As soon as that Arc Drive whiffed for Mars and he had no resources left, it was yeah. just kind of an inevitability. Oh yeah, you know, Mars kind of, you know, with that Arc Drive from Coma, it is a command grab, but at the same time, Bright side able to jump out of it, make Mars waste all of that resources and uh, take the second game. And right now, I think it's Bright Side's movement that's yes. been the biggest adjustment. Not only that, but using the preemptive air strings instead of looking for a single hit fatal counter, he's using the air the air strings to cage Coma back down to the ground. Oh, oh runs into the armor. Yeah, no follow up from the grab there in the corner. It charges up a little bit. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, but ran yeah, up a little too much. That's gonna be it for the round, right? Yes. Finally a momentum change on Mars's side. He had, uh, dropped four straight rounds heading into this one. Yeah, he really does. I mean, at this point he needs three games straight to win this grand final reset. Off to a good start nice. here though. Yeah, really good nice start. Backdash from bright side. Still got caught by the charge C. Oh, and again, caught the backdash, bright side. Trying to move a little too much. Wake up, grab, looking for the armor. Oh, DP's wow. Through. Yeah, that's, I mean, it works. Yeah, DP through the armor, but uh, Koma just not going to get caught by it at all. And Brightside just having the hardest time finding a hit right now. Oh, oh finally got one, but didn't believe in it and ah. going to get caught by the yeah, got caught. grab there. And Mars getting a game up in the reset. Two to one here. Like I said, a little bit of a hill for Mars to climb against Brightside. He can still make this adjustment to get this Grand Finals reset, but Mars starting this round really, really well. Charge again. Brightside, good movement just to get out of yeah, the corner. Just to get out. Let him waste that move. Skill. 
Yeah, that's gonna yeah, be a nice. punish. Yep. That that is actually a lot of times what you want to do when you avoid the command grab. It, instead of trying to do a normal and risking it uh, not reaching, if you have a fast horizontal move special, just mm -hmm. throw it out. Yeah. Why not? Throw it out. We'll get it back eventually. Especially with the way that you can cancel into C specials off of the regular ones and whatnot. Yeah. Like you, you can find a way to make a combo, uh, a combo yeah. route out of that. Yeah. Oh no! Runs into wow, another. Wow! Yeah, like getting caught with the. Yeah, you got caught with it. You got caught running in. And now, you know, we had set four straight rounds to Brightside. Now it's three straight in Mars' favor. Yeah, seriously. Wow. Yeah, he got caught pressing buttons against the armor. Mars getting in the corner. Here. Oh, shielded at each other. DP's yeah, out. Yeah, wake up DP. Nice. Oh! Oh, again. Maybe missed a uh, second 2A in there. Yeah, it was still able or to just had already dash. committed. And yeah. Oh, no! The backdash got caught by the moon skill. Full combo from uh, Mars here. Good patience. Yeah. DP's through the armor, able to get out of the corner, but still under duress here. Not gonna be enough here for Mars. He could spend to see. Yeah, he actually. Okay. Oh, oh and the fast wow. overhead follow yeah, up there. Fast overhead. And why wouldn't they add like a little bit of motion blur before the overhead mm -hmm. just to make it harder to see? And what a really impressive comeback from Mars here. Okay, ABC, air throw. Yeah, we're on the final game of our tournament. First hit, going to bright side. Yeah, fatal counter there in the air. Nice awareness there from the uh, the move drive activate. Oh, he backdashed out of the first part, but still got caught with the overhead. Yeah, backdashed out of a. Uh, <laughs> okay. I really like these partial kill. charge JCs. Yeah. Uh, just making it different timing on when that JC is actually coming out. Kind of hard for Brightside to keep up with right now, but he does get the landing recovery here. Yeah, he does. Yeah, Mars dashed in. Brightside able Good to block. get the landing frames. Ooh, that was a scary. Oh. That was a big overextension. Yeah, Gonna lose some meter here. Yeah, right side, I mean, he's gotta guy. maybe, he's gotta figure something out for this round because he went all in resources wise. Mm -hmm. He really can't afford to lose this round. Yeah, this is a good combo off the throw. Gonna activate, get all this health back. Right side. And runs into the charge, JC. Yeah. Right I think Brightside side was meter. a little worried about Mars getting all of that health back from the heat. In the overhead, and Mars has brought it oh back, and he's on God. tournament point. Mars, such good adjustments from him taking this game. And Brightside had the hit on the 2A. He just didn't believe in it, and going to 2A into armor now. Yeah, nice. Yeah, just seeing the air throw. Oh, my God, they both woke up heat, but Brightside taking the advantage there. Oh, big drop, though. Yeah, big drop. Oh, okay, nice mash out from Brightside. ABC. Oh, yep. Oh, armor is the, the follow armor. up after the jump. Oh, okay. Stuff's happening. Stuff Mars getting the 2A. The shield. Not going to be it just yet, but still got the setup. Yeah, no, no command grab there. Brightside trying his best. Oh, nice what backdash. a backdash. Oh, oh the armor. Mars going to seal it. it. Good stuff to Mars. Oh, uh, congratulations to Zen Mars for taking our second week of Melty Blood type Lumina with Coma. Everyone with the bar having a blast. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Shout out to Ignite. Of course, we are at Ignite Skokie. As you can see, full service bar in the event space. Very large space that they allow us to use every Friday night. <laughs> yeah. uh, enough, you know, enough room to spread out, play games as safe as we can. Uh, so, would like to remind everyone before we get out of here coming up, uh, as I mentioned, we're here most every Friday with the exception of the 22nd. We're mm -hmm. going to be taking that off. Next week, we're going to have, uh, you can see the whole month, we're doing Guilty Gear and Melty Blood. We run yes. three official games every week. Uh, and there's also some side tournaments here and there. Uh, so, you, if you want a game to be here, bring a setup. There's yep. room for it. Yep. Uh, the reason we're not here on the 22nd is so we can set up for a roundhouse on the yeah. 23rd. All of the Chicago TOs come together under one roof. You can see myself there, Shozo Senshi Senjo. Uh, I'm going to be running BB Tag, BBCF, and Grand Blue. Garage oh, yeah. Gear running uh, Guilty Gear Plus R, Exert Rev 2, and Strive. Uh, the LK Boys on the Super Saturday is going to be running mm -hmm. uh, almost everything that the rest of us aren't. Uh, of course, Chicago Tekken with the Tekken. Of course. We have uh, Marvel Mayhem. 
We have uh, Downtown Beatdown, the Central Illinois boys coming up, mm -hmm. and UGS mm -hmm. going to be rounding us out with the French Bread action. So looking forward to seeing you guys on the 23rd, 24th here at Ignite Skokie. And uh, with that, that's going to be actually all that we have for tonight. Uh, another shout out to Jolly Phobic. Thanks for joining me on the absolutely, commentary last absolutely. couple weeks. Uh, definitely been having a lot of fun with Melty Blood. Oh, so yeah. Yeah. Uh, that is going to be it for tonight, though. So thanks, everyone, for tuning in. We'll catch you next time. Yeah, thank you very much.